youth runner here with uh, all-time great at Winona State, uh, Kaylee Byer, uh, 2205 uh, in the Susie Wilson uh, Women's uh, Maroon 6K at the 38th Ray Act Invitational. Obviously, always blessed in any season to be able to see uh, Kaylee put, uh, putting in the work. Uh, you, you shared with me, obviously, this is kind of all the foundational time, you know, to make sure you're uh, ready to go when the calendar flips to 2025 on, on, on the track. So, you know, in, especially when it's it's such a challenging course, you know, and a course that requires so much discipline. Like, what aspects are you really trying to focus on? Not so much like the totality of 6K, mm -hmm. but like just kind of segmenting it and, you know, and, and the areas that you can really you know, uh, benefit from. Um, I'd say probably in that middle, like the middle K, probably from three to four. Definitely that's where it gets technically more challenging too, but if you try to keep it a little conservative in the beginning and then just work as much as I could there and then just bring it in <laughs> that last K. That's always part of my hardest part, but if I know I put in the work and the rest of the Ks, it usually it's good motivation to keep going. Good confidence. How, how would, I mean, in, in comparison to like a, you know, a, a previous fall when, you know, obviously it'd be, you know, you're, you're revving up for, yeah. you know, for conference and regionals and, and nationals all the time, you know, on grass and dirt and, and, and hill and trail, like just, I mean, how, like just how much patience and, you know, and just kind of how much, you know, just grace do you yeah. give yourself that it's just like, look, like anytime I get through one of these races healthy, you know, uh, and anytime I get through a good week of training healthy, like it's a, it's a blessing and a, and a benefit because you don't, you think, I mean, I know you want to be competitive in every setting and you certainly were today, but it's like, you know, we, we don't need to get ready to peak in November like you would have in the past. It's definitely a learning curve, um, still figuring it out. This is kind of the first race back just to get the base training going. Um, I just know that I want to stay in that competitive mindset a little bit throughout the fall just because it's good mentally for the spring when it's the fun part for me that gets going, but I know that this is the important part, so I just keep reminding myself is like these hills are beneficial for later in the season. This is all going to come back and just help me in the long run. So still learning it, still learning that patience. We'll see when more of the races that I have planned um, get going, how I can kind of reel it in a little bit, but also still push myself. So yeah, I'm excited. The, uh, the, the, the fact that I love you, I mean, I've always been so appreciative and, and I have so much respect for your range. The fact that you're telling me that you're going to, you know, potentially take on 10K yeah. you know, at, at, at some point in this fall. But, uh, but uh, and you know, and that doesn't surprise me because you've always been so ambitious and so courageous. But how unique is it, Kaylee, when it's not like, the same academic schedule all the time and the travel schedule and, yeah. and you know and always you know being around uh, the, the Winona group and and just kind of being able to kind of call your own shots you know mm -hmm. make your own schedule balance it with work you know yep. balance yep. it with post-collegiate real life yep. you know uh, how, how is that kind of all evolving for you it's it's going well right now um i will have to say it's a lot of waking up at five o'clock in the morning and getting a run in before work um but i always know that it's a new day and i'm excited to run in the morning when i'm not Towards the end of the week, I'm a little tired, so I sleep in, but I'm always excited to go for a run, um, and I'm excited that it's different, it's challenging, I'm still figuring it out, as I'm going to be traveling more, hopefully it's going to see how work goes in it, um, but I'm, I'm excited for the challenge, it definitely is a bit of a learning curve, I'm like two months in full time working, so it's coming along though, I say it's Getting the schedule is the biggest part, and I finally got one. I'm trying to stick to it as best I can, giving myself grace for when I don't stick to it, um, knowing that it's just all going to fall into place later. Awesome. So. Kaylee, always a blessing. Uh, can't you. wait to see okay. big 2025 uh, indoor and outdoor on, uh, on the track. Uh, stay healthy, and best of luck in all your endeavors. Thank you, Eric. Thank you so much. <laughs>